Thank you, Mark. Moving west from Kenton to Westminster, where we're getting ready for the 11th Music in the Park right here on July the 26th between 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. We're joined by Dustin Morris, the stage manager and Mr. Everything. Does a little bit of everything here at Music in the Park. How excited are you for this year? Oh, it's going to be great. We've got some great groups coming out. We have the Perrys, which is going to be our Southern Gospel group. Uh, Among the Thirsty, they're a contemporary Christian group. They're kind of up and coming. And then comedian Tim Lovelace. Uh, actually, he's a Hall of Fame inductee. Hmm. So so we're really excited. We're going to have the same stuff we've had in the past. We're going to have the inflatables for the kids. Uh, we're going to have free food. Mention free. Free food. Free I'll food. be there. So, yeah. so yeah, eat up as much as you want. Um, it's going to be on the 26th of July right here in the park. Um, just all we ask that you bring a lawn chair and a smile on your face. What else do you enjoy about this atmosphere, bringing people together and just seeing your community? Um, it's just really great to see all the age differences. Um, you know, we have everybody from age 90 to age, you know, brand, you know, newborn. Uh, <laughs> you know, there's, that's a great thing is that we have something for everybody. So there's something that everybody can enjoy. And uh, it's just, you know, getting to interact with a bunch of people from, from the area. And actually, we've had people come from as far as Toledo, oh, wow. uh, Dayton. So, yeah, it's, it's really wonderful to have an impact on the community like that. Who are some of the churches or organizations that come together to allow this to be a free event? Um, well, we have, of course, Westminster United Methodist Church. We have Herod Christian Church, um, Lafayette United Methodist, Westminster United Church of Christ. They've been generous enough to... Uh, allow us to use their parking lot and uh, they've also helped with uh, the past couple years with uh, organizing the event. It's such a laid-back event. I, I brought my two-year-old, three-year-old daughter and four-year-old son last year. It was just so much fun to get their face painted. The high school youth group gets involved, which I think is pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Um, our high school youth group has been very uh, involved in the event and we're looking forward to having them back this year. All right, so that is July 26th right here in Westminster. Music in the park. You can come for the church service in the morning, but if you can't, make sure you come for lunch and then stay all afternoon for a wonderful, wonderful time of corporate praise and worship to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And then the next big event is coming up August 22nd. This one is growing by leaps and bounds every year. It's called Waynestock Living for the Rock, and it's in St. Mary's. And that's where we head next to find out where your next stop will be for your free summer concert tour.